All right, welcome back to the C Morning Show. Happy weekend to everyone watching. Now, talking about spending your weekend, mm -hmm. especially uh, your cinephil. Mm -hmm. <laughs> have you guys uh, watched the latest Super Mario Brothers movie? I have not. I have you know who yet. starred the voice of um, Mario? Sorry? Do you know who starred the main uh, voice for Mario in the movie? Oh! I, I actually watched it with my son. Oh, you did? We only stayed for like 40 minutes of Why? the show. Why? It gets boring? Because my son wants to, uh, he wants to buy bub bubble tea. Oh. <laughs> so, I, so, thought he was, I thought he wants to buy the Mario uh, no, no, toys. No. I know um, Anya Taylor-Joy was in it. Yes, yeah, right? she was. She was. Um, but I forgot. Oh. Uh, ding, ding, ding. Guardians of the Guardians Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy. It's Chris uh, Pratt. Chris yeah. Pratt. It's Chris uh, Pratt. Yeah, yes. that guy. It that has good. been almost a month after its worldwide release and debut. <laughs> the Super Mario Brothers movie is still breaking all sorts of records around the globe. It has successfully achieved income about 377 million US dollars in the first six days after its release, beating Frozen 2 with 358 million wow. US dollars in 2019. It's the in the first week release. Warcraft, 210 million US dollars and the Angry Birds movie in 2016 for <laughs> just 38 million US dollars. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. wow, I even forgot that I watched this this movie. I still remember Super Mario, yeah. but I didn't remember about the Angry Birds. Yeah, they, yeah, they have a movie starring Jason yeah. Sudeikis. Yeah, that's one of them. Yeah. Angry yeah. Birds? Angry Birds movie. Angry Birds, oh, okay. very Never popular, watched that one. very annoying birds. <laughs> yeah. But I like the game, though. I like yeah. the game. Like Who the game? Oh, I didn't. Who doesn't? Oh. Okay, speaking about the Super Mario, Super Mario so the Super Mario Bros. movie facts, uh, the Super Mario Bros. movie makes seven, 377 million US dollars or 5.6 trillion rupees six days wow. after its release. Crazy. Wow! Recorded as the animated movie with the biggest revenue record in... In history. Yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah, in history. And I still remember the, the game as well. So the Super Mario Bros. movie beats uh, Frozen uh, 2 with uh, 358 million US dollar, Warcraft 210 million US dollar, and the Angry Birds movie 38 million US dollar. Wow, lots of money involved. Do you guys still remember about the Super Mario Bros. Back I do. The, yeah. the game. I do. I do. There are ten levels, is it? Yes, there's ten levels. Ten or and the last twelve. Level is... Twelve levels. 12 levels. 12, 10 or 12 levels. Really? It's either 1, 10 or 12, but the last level was Around in that. Bowser's Castle. Yes! Uh, it's scary, scary a scary level. scary one. Yep. And then I like when I got the mushroom, when we got bigger. Up, yep. Yeah! Uh, we, can, we can throw flame uh, exactly. balls from our hands. Yeah. I never, I never really played the game in Nintendo. Really? But I played it in a, in a game. Boy? Yeah, oh. it's a Nintendo Game Boy. I play it in Nintendo. In uh, Nintendo, yeah. okay, yeah. the retro one. Yes. Okay. <laughs> now um, let's uh, talk more about a movie adapt um, adaptation from games. So let's walk down the memory lane to see our legendary uh, game list. Let's go. First one is uh, <laughs> Pac-Man. It it's Pac-Man. Oh so Pac-Man, okay, originally it. called Puck-Man in uh, Japan, Puck. is a 1980 maze action video game developed and released by Namco for arcades. In the North America, the game was released by Midway Manufacturing as part of its licensing agreement with a Namco America. The player controls Pac-Man, who must eat all the dots inside the enclosed maze while avoiding four colored ghosts. Yeah, oh. I, I also remember this game. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm stuck at this. Thing. I'm You're stuck so? at this. Really, <laughs> I hate. Ah, I keep on dead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, eating large flashing dots called power pellets uh, causes the ghosts uh, to temporarily turn blue, allowing, uh, allowing Pac Man to eat them for bonus points. Pac-Man was a uh, widespread critical and commercial success, leading to several uh, sequels, uh, merchandise, and two television series. Wow. Now, the game remains one of the highest grossing and best-selling games, generating more than 14 billion US dollars in revenue and 43 million units in sales combined. 
and has an enduring commercial and cultural legacy, commonly listed as one of the greatest video games of all time. But um, when you imagine playing it in an arcade yeah. machine, yeah. I think it's going to be, you know, the sensation will be different. Yeah. Right? Because we play it, I play it also in Game Boy. Yeah, oh, I'm playing yeah, in the different. arcade too. Yeah. You play in a car? Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you yeah, remember yeah. where was it? Uh, no, I didn't remember. <laughs> I remember. I remember playing in arcades in uh, movie theaters. That's ah. where I play arcades the most. Ah, yeah, yeah. I remember. I have this game too. Yeah. Wow! It's, it's, this game is everywhere <laughs> on your phone, on your yeah. Game Boy. Yeah. You name it. Game Boy. Exactly. Yeah. Well, let's move on to our next list. It's All right. It's Whoa. called Final Fantasy. Nah. Aha! <laughs> I remember this one this too. This is familiar to you. PlayStation, right? But yes, it is. Really? It is for the PlayStation. Okay, Final Fantasy is a, fi a fantasy role-playing video game developed and published by Square Enix in uh, uh, 1987. Focus. And it is the first game in Square's Final Fantasy series created by Hironobu Sakaguchi. Originally yes. released for the NES, Final Fantasy was remade for several video game consoles and is frequently packaged with Final Fantasy II in video game collections. The first Final Fantasy story follows four youths called the Warriors of Light, who each carry one of their world's four elemental crystals, which have been darkened by the four elemental fiends. Together, the quest to defeat these evil forces, restore light to the crystals, and save their world. The original is now regarded as one of the most influential and successful role-playing games on the Nintendo Entertainment System, playing a major role in popularizing the genre. By March of 2003, all versions of Final Fantasy had sold a combined of 2 million copies worldwide. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nintendo. I, I used to have a Nintendo back home. <laughs> yeah. How about PlayStation? Yes, this game is also in PlayStation. And I think now it's, we're up to, I think we're down to the Final Fantasy, is it 11? Uh, or no, it's, I didn't it's, follow. I didn't <laughs> play the first one. They, play, they make so many uh, Final Fantasy uh, games after that. Oh, really? It's crazy. Because I quit the playing. The gameplay different. I quit really? playing a, a game, uh -huh. I think around when I was, I don't know. Secondary school. Really? <laughs> when I go to junior high and then stop, you yeah. you have to learn. Yeah, it's a, it's a long time ago. Exactly. Yeah, it's a different it's a different age, right? Yeah. Because right now gamers gamers made lots of millions exactly. US dollars, yeah. and then yeah. back then when we play the game, it's like, dude. No. You need to study. You need yeah. to study. You have to study. You have to, study. You have to quit. And <laughs> my still. dad throw away my... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Because, yeah he wants us, the kids, have to study. Yeah. yeah but... And then, okay, fine. Yeah. <laughs> But there's a lot of fun games back yeah. then yeah. when I was a kid. This one is also really fun. Oh, yeah, 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 really yeah. fun, really fun. I remember I played it on Sega, and this one, I, I also suck at this. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm not a gamer. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm going to talk about Sonic the Hedgehog, and yeah. it's a um, 1991 platform game developed by Sonic Team and published by Sega for the Sega Genesis Mega Drive. Players control Sonic the Hedgehog, who can run at supersonic speeds. Yeah. Sonic sets out on a quest to defeat Dr. Robotnik, a scientist who has imprisoned animals in robots and seeks the powerful Chaos Emeralds. I remember I played Tails. Yeah. You played Tails. Tails. And there's Knuckles also. Yes. Yeah, the game involves <laughs> collecting rings as a form of health and uh, a simple okay. control scheme with jumping and attacking controlled by a single button. Development began in 1980 when Sega ordered its developers to create a game featuring a mascot for the company. The developers chose a blue hedgehog designed by Naoto Oshima after he won an internal character design contest and named themselves Sonic Team to match their character. Oh, I remember the Sonic game because, yeah. yes, <laughs> on Sega, I don't have Sega, I only have Nintendo, so I borrow to my cousins yeah. to play Sonic, and then it was hard, yes. Very yeah, hard. I agree. So, Sonic the Hedgehog uh, was well received by critics who praise its visuals, audio, and gameplay. It is widely considered one of the greatest video games of all time, and it was also commercially successful, Ooh. becoming one of the best-selling video games of all time with approximately 24 million copies sold <laughs> worldwide across all platforms. 
platform. Yes, this, <laughs> this is <laughs> this is funny. This is fun as yeah. well. So fun. And, <laughs> yeah. I remember Look I at this. Yeah. Look at this. Who doesn't want to play this game? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Compared to um, compared to Mario Bros. That yeah, this time. is yeah, this is yeah. interesting levels like exactly. this as well. And the speed is more faster yeah. than yeah, the this is Super faster Mario. Than Mario Bros. Fast, yeah, and more fast. colorful. Yeah. They actually made two movies of yes. this game. Yes, yeah. And yeah. it starred Jim Carrey as uh, ah, Dr. Robotnik. Okay. And it's actually his last role in any movies. Oh, he's, yeah. He hasn't done any roles since exactly. then. Yeah, 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 yeah. Since yeah, yeah. Dr. Robotnik in oh uh, Sonic God. the Hedgehog 2. And I remember um, my, my sister is... She's awesome playing this. Mm -hmm. And I remember um, at one point I dreamt about Dr. Robotnik. <laughs> He came to my house, you? kidnapping me, and ruined my house, and it was it was a nightmare. Right? It was, it was, it was like a nightmare. Sega. Yeah, it's it's all because of Sega. Oh my God. Well, don't blame Sega too much. <laughs> uh, moving on oh to the next God. game. This is a game that I used to play a lot. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is Winning Eleven, or wow. now is uh, known for Pro Evolution Soccer, or PES. Known also as Winning in Live in Japan and North America, is a series of association football simulation video games developed and published by Konami from 1995 until 2020. The series consists of 18 uh, main installments and several spin-offs, including the mobile game for Evolution Soccer Club Manager, listed as one of the best-selling video game franchises, the series has sold uh, 111 million copies worldwide in addition to 400 million mobile downloads by December 2020. In the late 2000s, EA borrowed gameplay elements from PES into FIFA, which eventually pulled ahead commercially by a significant margin in the 2010s and emerged as the world's most successful sports video game franchise. The rivalry between FIFA and PES is considered the greatest rivalry in the history of sports video games. Mm. Just looking at this brings so many memories. <laughs> so many memories. This so game, I didn't play. The, you didn't play this game. They no. used to have these tournaments, right? Yeah. Everywhere, right? Yeah. For, for uh, Winning Eleven. For Winning Eleven. Eleven. This is uh, such a household game to play. Yeah. yeah. And they can play it for hours and hours, hours. and days. hours. And days months. and nights. Exactly. <laughs> and months. Oh and, and months. months. Oh, oh my this god. Is, this is a fun, such a fun game. And yeah. if you own a PC... Ah! This particular game. game. I love this one. Yeah. Do you play The Sims? I play, I play the, Sims. Uh, the first release of The Sims. Yeah. And then I didn't I didn't follow, I didn't uh, continue to play because it's so hard <laughs> yeah. to plan. But, but you remember the, the language, right? Come on, dodge not. Come on, dodge not. <laughs> okay, let's talk about The Sims as a social simulation video game developed by Maxis and published by Electronic one. Arts in 2000. It is a simulation of the daily activities of one or more virtual people called Sims in a suburban household near a fictional city. Players control customizable, uh, customized, customized able Sims as they pursue career and relationship goals. I love this game because I can play God in this game. <laughs> so players can also use their Sims income to renovate their living space this and is, purchase this home hard. furnishings or clothing for their household. Now players can also choose to um, pursue a um, social status, um, social uh, and successful life and the game's development was led by Will Wright and the game was a follow-up to Wright's earlier SimCity series and upon release the Sims garnered widespread critical acclaim and was described as um, being successful in attracting casual and female gamers like Yay. me. Yeah. Yay. Everybody's talking about the Sims. <laughs> yeah. It also won several awards and placed 31st on Times, the 50 best video games of all time list. The game began, the game has also been commercially successful, being one of the best selling PC games of all time. With 11.5 million copies sold, several sequels were released, and, si and The Sims 2 was released in 2004. The yeah. Sims 3 was released in 2009, and The Sims 4 in 2000. And oh, I, love I didn't follow anyone. I love this game. I love this yeah. game. I once um, called in to my lecturer. I said I was um, sick mm -hmm. for but, four days. But you were actually. Because I was playing Sims yeah. at that time. I was playing The Sims, and yeah. I was building this castle. So I don't want to. 
I don't want to go to any class. Were you studying <laughs> architecture? No, oh, I was no, okay. I was studying design actually. Oh, <laughs> but, see, but yeah, yeah. The Sims is perfect for really? uh, design students and architect students. Really? Back then. I mean, they could spend hours doing that. Yeah, I My love friend who's an architect right now still spends time playing The Sims oh, just wow. to get the, uh, her mind off things. Yeah, I, I think the second back. and then the fourth, until the fourth, they developed very well. Yeah. The colors, uh, the character as well, yeah. and the story too. The story, but I, I made my own story. Yeah. Because <laughs> I made this, I made this um, ghost house. Yeah where I killed all the Sims there. Wow. And then they, they haunted oh. each other like yeah, yeah. every <laughs> single day. Yeah. And it was the best game ever because I had to have a ghost what house is, is, in the complex. <laughs> it's what very, yeah. what, is, what was going on through getting, your mind? Getting <laughs> you did that? for some <laughs> you, you know how to kill them. Uh, you just make a pull and, and then you, you, you take out the ladder. <laughs> you, take right? the ladder. <laughs> you, take, you take out the ladder. <laughs> Shana's had her ideas. <laughs> I love The Sims too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I love The Sims too. Yeah. yeah. I, love I mean, games are good for uh, taking our mind off things. Yeah. Just to relax Actually. for a bit. That's why games are most found right now on our phones. Yeah. 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 I really Not love my favorite. But I really love to play all the puzzles games, you know, like really? solitaires or, you know, like um, Tetris. Oh, smart uh, games. Tetris. Smart games. Those are smart games. Oh. Smart games. Oh, Sudoku. I don't, I don't Sudoku play Sudoku is very game. intellectual. Play that game. <laughs> well, until this point, I still own a PlayStation 4 and I still play with my friends. Really? So oh, I, really? I'm actually... Can the, I come over? Of course, come over. <laughs> uh, the more the merrier. No, <laughs> I think I'm the only gamer until this point. In really? Oh, really? uh, yeah, you, yeah. Are you watching the gamer? Because, no, nope, I'm not playing any games at the time. Yeah. No, no. I, I play Sudoku. You no. play the game of life. I play the game. Of life. <laughs> the game of love. The it's done. Okay. All right. Guys. All right. 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 All